Hello everyone! For this video, we will be reviewing the B-189 Guilty Longinus Karma Metal Destroy 2. So, it is a new Longinus. Very excited to take a look at it. If you're wondering, the main advertisement is all the metal on it. So, just to show the back, uh, we do get some interesting stuff. It's basically, it's gimmicks just to hit hard, really. I mean, you know, upper attack, the disc can hit you with, well, the disc has a very cool shape and, you know, upper attack, upper attack, you get the idea. And perfect belly out. So going over to our first part, we have the Longinus core. So this is a very interesting core. Why is that? Well, for the simple reason that there is metal on it. So on this core, it features metal. The design is very similar to Zvi Longinus. And it reminds me a lot of uh, Lost Longinus for kind of how the metal is on there. It's got a lot of nice vibes on it. Now as far as, now here's a little bit of a side view. Now as far as teeth goes, uh, the teeth are a little bit blocky. Uh, I don't see the teeth lasting too long. No, I don't know. Well, the thing is, yeah, not on a metal driver, obviously, on a dash, yeah, I'll be fine. Maybe a little bit of wear after a little bit of usage, but uh, it does look like it's gonna have strong locks. The other thing too is that this is super heavy, so already viability is like, well, you got that core right there. So moving on, we have got our Guilty Blade. So this blade is really crazy. So you can see that what they did was on the main contact point there, it is plastic, plastic, and then after metal around there, metal, 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 so you can get the idea. And if you look at it, again, you know, the upper, the upper attack vibes, the upper attack vibes. And what's really uh, cool about it too is that underneath it, it will also uh, smack you. You can see there's a little bit of metal there and everything. Only on this part, the rest is just metallic paint. But it does really make you think, how powerful is this going to be? There's also uh, the two armor, which is uh, repeated. I don't really care. Personally, I'm just going to use this once I get spare stickers. So then after that, we have our disc, which is Karma. So Karma reminds me a lot of the nine disc we got previously on the original Lost Longinus. Longinus. And with it, oh, hey, look at the stars, nice. With it, you can kind of see the blades that kind of divide itself, kind of like, you know, it's there, and then after there, different levels. It does look like it's gonna hit really hard, and I'm really excited to use Longinus uh, just to see how powerful is it gonna be. And the last part, which I, I'm not the biggest fan, it is Metal Destroy. It's in the colors of the original Destroy. Uh, I don't like metal drivers. Uh, quick TLDR, metal drivers will wear teeth fast. They are pointless. I would have been fine with just a normal jolt dash, whatever. Uh, with that being said, there's also the L gear. Now to go over this is where we actually have to first get on the scale. So with the L gear, this will finally complete your belly out. So with the L gear, the total weight we are looking at is about 15.51 grams. So we have, I have two different belly outs, devil and normal because it puts it in high mode either way. If I lock this all together now, you're looking at about 33.8 grams. And then after the total weight, four belly owl completed, perfect. 82.44. So let us take a look at it after we show it off with uh, Devil. Actually, yeah, I'll, I'll show the side view first, then after we'll get to that, okay. So just to show it off, yeah, a little bit of a side view. Yeah, it's in, it's in high mode now. So now we're gonna show it with uh, Devil with the L-Gear. With the Devil Blade, this is what it looks like with the L-Gear. Yulti is looking at a total of about 10.10 .10 grams. The Yulti Blade is a whopping 17 grams. That is insanely heavy. Then after there is uh, the two armor, which, uh, you know, I, I didn't really want to go over, but 13.8. Uh, Karma is about 29.23. Metal Destroy is about 8.91. 
Altogether now you're looking at almost about 80 grams. Obviously it can vary with parts and weight and everything. So take a look at this. Wow, that looks cool. Nice, really actually love the design on it. it. It looks really good. A side view. Okay, now let's get this in high mode. Here is Guilty Longinus in high mode. So a side view, nice. Okay, for all of the evolutions, Lost Nightmare, Bloody Zvi, Rage, and then after Guilty, I think Longinus has had a very solid evolution line. The only time that Longinus was at its weakest was probably Chozy with Bloody Longinus, to be quite honest. But, you know, I like it quite a bit. Uh, we're going to have fun with uh, the battles. Uh, just to go over, they do some little combinations here. If you want to see it on the paper, go ahead. The, usually the combos aren't good. Uh, then after next month, which is a Belial Evolution, a Phoenix Evolution, and I believe Savior Perseus. So... Ah, excited for that. Okay, so since we already have this in its high mode, I figured, hey, let's do the test launch and do some battles. So, three, two, one, go shoot. Oh, it moves, all right, it moves. Very nice. Oh yeah, we also have to launch a uh, perfect belly out too, just to see. Just gonna... All right, perfect belly out, three, two, one, go shoot. All the upgrades, all in one. All right then, well, let's get started. Uh, since I already have it in high mode, my only high mode battle for this video will be against Perfect Belial, so that'll be very fitting. Ooh, powerful hits. All right, who's gonna get it, Guilty or Belial? Do all the upgrades mean anything, or is it going to be defeated right here and now? Oh, probably OS, actually. Yeah. All right, well, hey, nice. I am in high mode after all, so that is nice. Yeah, don't use a metal driver, please. Don't, just just use a normal dash. Just use a normal dash, because I don't, I don't like metal drivers, because they slide. Like, I'm going to give you an example, actually, so you can understand. Okay, so if I put a metal driver on right now, you're going to hear the clicks, right? They don't sound as strong. Okay. So if I put a normal dash right now, yeah, obviously they're gonna have a little bit stronger clicks. I don't like metal drivers. Push in low mode, hold on. All right, very nice. In the hands. Okie dokie. Now let's see how it does. Savior, oh, and it already activated. Wow, that did not take long. And it scared Savior off before it could even make an attack. That is, it, it is so powerful that it, it's scaring the bays away. All right, between Astral Right and Guilty, who gets it? Probably, probably Astral because of the overdisc. Yeah, don't expect it to win via stamina. It is, it is smacking really hard though, so I am, I am a fan of that. Okay. Power of a DB Stadium. All right, let's hit, let's even crash down. It'll, it'll probably waste its stamina, but. Uh, yeah, I, I, I think these rounds show that it is definitely a powerful attack type. Oh, dude, look at the hits. Nice. Well, I mean, it's, it's, jeez. Yo, it, it's, shipping a, it's shipping a lot of the paint on my stuff. I don't, all right, relax, buddy, relax. All right, Roar Bahamut, everybody. Roar Bahamut. I just realized they probably probably didn't pick Jolt Dash because of the DB Stadium. But Destroy Dash, look at that. Just made Bahamut trash. That rhymed. Okay, good. Vanish. Vanish. 
Actually, I don't know how Vanish is gonna. Vanish will probably tank it because it's uh, it's a it's a good stamina. It's a good grammar. It's a, it's a good it's a good stamina type. It's a good stamina type. It can tank attacks. I'm not expecting Stalk Guilty to somehow OS it. Oh yeah, if it wants to. Oh, but that was really close. All right, so so far what I'm getting from this is stamina depletes fast, but insane attack type. I nearly got KO'd. Woo, oh my God, relax. Wow, it is really, dude, it is pushing Cyclone. Oh my God. Dude, it is like, Killing Cyclone, man. Okay, Cyclone, you wanna know what? You wanna know what? I'm gonna bring back the high mode for the last battle of the video. All right, then after I'll give final thoughts. I'm curious how high mode does. I wonder, will it be? Oh, wow, look at the clicks on this thing. Damn, it already, I'm pretty sure that's nearly like halfway. Dude, it just hits. That's like, it just hits hard. It's, it's, God. This thing is like insanely powerful. I love it. I love it. All right, final thoughts out of 10. I'm gonna be giving this. Eh. Honestly, I give it like a nine. I'm gonna give it a nine. Uh, pros, it hits you know, incredibly hard. Okay, the pros literally like the longinus core, the guilty blade. I don't know about the karma disc. Yeah, two is whatever. Metal destroy. Nah. Is this worth getting? Uh, most definitely. This thing hits like crazy. I can already imagine the carnage on a standard stadium, what that's gonna do. And a DB stadium, it already proved its worth by almost killing all of the bays easily. Almost. So yeah, this is definitely a bay that is worth your money. Now, speaking of which, a little ad at the end. We have a shop where we sell, where we have amazing deals on Guilty Longinus, for an example. In the comments, what videos do you want to see and why? Let me know. Thank you for watching. Have an amazing day.